What's happening, beautiful gamers? Blank here, and welcome back to another episode of Astra Hunter Sosma. And well, after the turn of events two episodes ago, and now that we have seen, thanks to the previous Void, how powerful we are, it's time for us to go to the 32nd floor. And well, it's time for us to pretty much, with our sister, help out somebody else before we help her out. Anyways, the nep, what's going on? What, do you guys see that we're gonna have yet another twist? I think Sosma is gone gonzo, and this is all a dream, but we'll figure that out later. What's up, the nep? Sis, I know our reunion has been brief, but time is of the essence. Ahead lies the next arena of the tower. Once you travel through this next arena, we will be at the top. You are the only one who, can count, who I can count on. Are you ready to go? Yes. Sosma, this will be the last person in this tower that I will have you meet. I know you are eager to grant my wish, but I will only allow you to once you learn the truth. The truth? The truth about what? Everything that has happened, it has happened for a reason. And you are the only one who can bring about a new cycle for everyone here. I will see you at the top. Please do not let me down. I do not understand why it still says Penumbra, considering that it's my sister. Show me that you are a real Astra Hunter. Show me that you're worthy of finally carrying this title. I... Bye, bitch. Or maybe Penumbra is actually lying to us. Who knows? Anyways, let's go. What are you gonna say about that, Sosma? By the way, what's up with the Power Ranger suit of Sosma? I do not want to let the net down. But she told me that I need to be worthy of calling myself an Astra Hunter. Doesn't that mean I still have improved myself? Even after everything that I have gone through? What am I doing all of this for then? Meow. Yeah. I guess we'll get the answers we need soon. Doesn't that make me any less frustrated, I'll admit. Why does everyone here have to mess with me? I mean, you cannot have like a fuckable face, Osma, so that's not their fault. And here we go. Wow, welcome. I've been expecting you. Ah, it's you. Is this the devil? The nap informed me that you would be arriving soon. I am Violet Necromancer Nadir. It is good to see that you have made it so far up the Crescent Moon Tower. Just tell me what your wish is. I do not have time for formalities. I have to help my sis. A wish. Yes, I do believe you have been granting wishes most amicably. I must applaud your efforts. But, as for my wish, why? I do not have one. So, don't, you do not have a wish? No, my friend. For I am simply here to help you along the road ahead. Please take this. The Warlock Sigil. I hope this will prove useful. Consider it your first step on the journey ahead. Please, follow me. In this place, you will learn many things, both about this tower and about yourself. Do not keep me waiting. A man without a wish. How am I supposed to help someone like that? Meow. A Ficus Obelisk. And here we go. Now, to start things like with a bang the correct way, let's make sure that we have the correct sigils equipped. So we know that this one, Plunder is pretty good, but Necromancer seems sick. We have the Hero Sigil equipped. Uh, Bastion is too good. This one is too good. Mm. We cannot remove this because we have to equip one of these. So I'm going to be removing. Yeah, I'll remove this one to equip this one. Just to see how it works. I think life pack would be good. Maybe. And then... Am I missing something? Oh yeah, energy blast is kind of like a garbage power, so we don't care. Yes. I think this is fine. And now, take a look at the walls. I was making sure that we didn't miss on anything. 
a shop. You really want to buy something in a place like this? Not that I'm complaining. What can I get you today, boy? If you knew. I don't really need to buy anything from you, but whatever. Oh, this place give me the creeps. Do take care on your travels, though. Sure. And here we go. Here it goes. So this is like a, this is a necromancer tower. So I'm pretty sure that something is gonna happen in here. Like you're gonna have to find a bottom or something. That's gonna be the secret. No interactions with this. First fight. Oh what the? It's an eye with a bat. And I'm poisoned. Um, what is this? Life shock. Sacrifice HP to deal physical damage to one enemy. But it requires ah that's the fact that it requires SP is the fact that it's like it's a little bit sad. But this one sacrifice to gain a lot of SP. That's actually sick. Really sick, but it still consumes a start turn. So, anyways, start with zeal. That way we can actually clap it up or start pumping it up. And then let's see how much damage we can actually deal. That's a second. Third. Fourth. And then meteor strike. Or run. Oh, we don't have run. Okay, meteor strike. Goodbye. Oh yeah, this is gonna be a breeze. Yep, this is gonna be the, the easiest thing that I've ever done. Look at this. This is gonna be way too easy. You know, when we're talking about Necromancer, can I figure we were gonna be using health to like do stuff? But I didn't figure that it was that, I don't know. I felt like, I felt like it was gonna be like absorbing health, not using health. Anyways, that's a level up. That's beautiful. You guys have noticed so far that we haven't have to, how do you call this, farm a single time. And yet, even at the hardest difficulty, at this point, we're pretty strong. Nothing can really stop us. Okay, let's show everybody what's up. Okay, that's fire. We understand. Jesus Christ. Anyways, fire thunder. Probably doing a little bit of damage, not that much. Yep. That's fine. Perfect. And then... Do you guys see that... Um, runabout is gonna kill them? Yep. I think... I think there's something that I didn't notice. I'm gonna take a look at my skills next time that I have to fight them. But I believe that something that I didn't notice with my skills is that... Run around or run about does damage both physical and magical oh no it just inflicts attack down and in down oh i didn't know that's actually pretty good anyways we can start doing this second third fourth fifth finish him oh that's so much damage but of course, the only thing that we're gonna have to be careful about with all of that is that I'm gonna have to be using these field potions because if they attack first, that's gonna be pretty bad. Give me this. Stabilizer. Nope. It would be great if we can get more speed because that way they don't have to attack first. If I can attack first, that would be the best way. I can just finish them off without having to receive any damage. Uh, nope. Fight them. You guys know the rules. First battle is gonna be going, like, it's gonna be always me attacking and making them suffer. But at this point, we're in the strategy, so... who knows? Sayonara. So much experience, it's so good. 3,000 experience per defeat. And they aren't even that hard, it's just that they're fast. Uh, that's the correct path. I revive treat, we take those, and let's go. Ah, we get a book. Library book number one, and there's a bunch of XZ whatever. Box World Bash by Robert C. I think one of the bookshelf shelf the library book in here? No. Wait. Box? What? Oh, I think that if we're gonna be paying attention, this one is probably gonna be B. The book fits on the shelf, yeah. 
And then we get this one, book number three, five stories from Lamp. So that's F. Wait! What? Oh, defense ring. I'll take this. Perfect. And what do you mean by... Five stories from Lamp Land by Shade L. So it's either going to be S or L, if I have to guess. L? Yep, so it, it might be the name. So this is library book number two. This is by this is by Elias Scholler. So Elias, 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 number E. Why? Wait! I am confused! So, the Canbrook Cantaloupe by Elias S. Teller. Oh, maybe the S. Another S? No, because I think it's the S. Unless it is T. No, then T? What the fuck? How do I know which one is the perfect one? And there's just one more. The Meriday Murders by Flatty B. So, Flatty B popping. Spits! And then, uh, popping, popping, popping. Maybe P? What the fuck? Okay, I mean, we get the... We got the treasure. Oh, maybe once we get the thing, it's gonna tell me, like, exactly what is it that I missed. But you know what? We got it! Oh, haha, -ha, and that's the one that's gonna tell me. God dang it! I just made my life harder! Oh boy, that was a lot of damage. That's one. Second one. Third. That's a lot of damage that we deal, even though he's supposed to be fire. Anyways, I just want that level up, so let's keep going. Uh, yep, there should not 25. Good librarian, shelf fiction, books by author. Yeah, it says by author. God dang it, that... It wasn't by author, I swear. Unless I did something... You guys can let me know in the comment section down below. What is it that I did wrong? Oh, shit. That's bad. Whatever. But yeah, if I did something wrong, you guys can let me know in the comment section down below, because I have no idea. And then run about... One more level. And I cannot wait to level up. Uh, just to be on the safe side, uh, give me a field potion. Let's go. And don't talk. Okay, he went straight up. In this tower, you have met many different people who lived during many different points in history. Though their lives ended long ago, this tower allowed their legacies to be preserved. But only here as they were unable to move on to the afterlife. Everyone here had something amazing that they wished to accomplish. What is that that you want to accomplish, Sosma? I want to show my sister the Neb that I can be a capable astra hunter and carry on her legend. I want to return home and do her proud. Returning home, that would be quite a feat indeed. Considering the circumstances, you are dead. Before you can leave this tower, there is something that you must come to understand. Yep, I I passed already. I'm go I'm, I'm I'm gone. Talking about that, let's take a look at the treasures. I think there's only tre three treasures left. Wait, what? One, two, three, four, five. What the freak? And this tower has the five left. Oh my god. This is this is gonna be a long one. We know it. Uh, we can use these powers to move around, that's fine. Oh, look at that, there's a, there's a switch. So we have to go up and then down, fine. Another switch in there, fine. Twice. Good job, my little friend. Good job. Down. Okay, so it triggers another bottom, so we're probably gonna have to trigger both. And then... Uh, hey, don't ignore me, you dick. Haven't leveled up just yet yet? Yeah, perfect. You attacked the perfect person. That's it. Listen, I can use revive treats to revive that little fella, okay? So it doesn't really matter. Uh, 
and then bye. Level up. We didn't. We get more speed. Yeah, but we didn't get more focus. I think every two levels you get one point of focus. That's kind of like how the dev kind of like balanced it out because it seems like something. Oh my god. Okay. I fought them for no reason. I guess I only fought once, so that's fine. Ah, uh, we're still not fast enough. Uh, okay, whatever. Uh, this is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do this. One. Second. Third. Let's go, and the meteor strike should finish him off. Beautiful. After that, I wanna make sure that I use... Seal... Not seal. Wait. Oh, I cannot wait. No, I should have another healing. Wait, where's my other healing power? Did I remove it? Oh shit, I think it did. Oh well, shit happens. Meteor strike him. Oh, he used bash. That's that's okay. And now flash here. That's good. Goodbye. Nice damage. Thank you. 26. Two parts food for a squirrel. Okay, this is this is gonna be this is gonna be key for us to figure out. So this is the moment where you know you take a nice I'm taking photos instead of screenshots because that, that way I don't have to change the screen. One part cow and one part something all a monkey likes, aka bananas. Anyways, from here what do we have to do? Right. But both ends have like um gems, so gems are kinda like important to follow. Beautiful. Another bottom. Oh, and you have to trigger both. Gotcha. Oh, no, there is. You don't have to... Okay, I thought the, the wall was gonna, like, fall or something, but not. Nah, not the case. There you go. <laughs> really? Really? Okay. Whatever. Okay, so it said... Two parts food for a squirrel... Food for a squirrel. Jar of nuts, yes. Okay, two parts that. Then one part liquid from a cow, aka milk. Beautiful. And then monkey. Beautiful. Let's get to cooking. I drop all the ingredients and that should be good enough. There you go. Smells great. That's it. Fancy. We got the golden barrel. Let's go. AKA Donkey Kong barrel. Okay, this is where the magic starts, right? Oh, this is this is trippy. This is trippy. The way that you have to do this is really trippy because it's on the corners. So you have to like be moving and be moving like in You cannot move diagonally, so you have to like ah, I hate this. Don't really like it. Okay. Uh, here we can transform. That's beautiful. There is the treasure, so that's great. Give me that. Oh, this time it's two eyeballs. This is fantastic. There is no better than the delicious taste of eyeballs in the morning. Have you guys ever eaten eyeballs? They are absolutely delicious. Not like I would know about it. Anyways, if you guys have actually tried it, good job, I guess. I mean, are they good? Let's water it. Uh, do I have to break something? Yes, I do. Let's go. Oh, hello. Oh, god dang it. I got nervous and I thought the battle was gonna start, so I kinda like stopped. But then the game was like, no, it's actually not starting. So then I decided to move and then the game was like, bro. And I was like, listen. I don't have time to overthink situations, okay? Beautiful. Now, if we get one more point in focus, that means that our next attack is gonna start doing 190. Oh boy. Oh boy. Those that you find like that, you gotta like immediately use them. Because that extra damage is a lot. It's big T. It's a, it's a big boy damage, so. Do not go that way. That's why it stops me, so I cannot be walking around with my boy. Gotcha. Break everything. Treasure Note on 27. Some bosses just like to tell you their weakness. 
Saves you a lot of trouble. Okay. Sure. We're about to fight. We're, we're about to face a boss. I mean, I guess I'm glad that you're telling me. Oh, I see. This place feels strange and empty. A terrible feeling to have while doing business. What can I get you today? Uh, honestly, you don't have anything that I want. Uh, we know that a boss fight is coming because he said it, so let's cut this out. And then, let's save. Theories, if you can't count on anyone to have your bag, you can count on your friend to save point. Oh, freak, I will use the field potion for no reason. Dang it. Anyways, boss fight, yep. Are you gonna tell me your weakness, boy? Bring it on. Let's go. Oh, he's weak to physical attacks. Okay, I mean, sure. That two. Third one. And now all of this is I'm charging so I can use a meteor strike. Wait, resistance? Why? Wait, wait, wait. How was he resistant to meteor strike? Oh, wait. Wait, he's resisting those. I can use high blaze to fuck him up, but I need to charge up too. Okay, I need to do something different. So a little bit of magic won't hurt anybody. Do one of these so we can keep charging up. That one should be good enough. High blaze. Yep, we know it's not only weak, but we also reduce his defense. So now I start pumping it up. Beautiful. That's a fantastic healing, man. Uh, give me a flash cure. Now, we cannot really do anything, so we're gonna have to start hitting him with, like, whatever we can. Just to pump up our stats. And then, just because I'm cool, uh, Tidal Wave, Grand Gamble, Tintacle. Ah! Ouch! Okay, Thunder Resistance up. Flash Cure. And, uh, yeah, we don't have... Had I known that this battle was gonna be like that, maybe I would have done something different, not really. Okay, that's fine. And, uh, yep, just do this. Next turn, he's gonna do some damage to us, that's fine. Perfect. Now, uh, just physical attack, yeah, he goes down. I wonder. Yeah. Can run around, can run house, finish him? Yep. Ooh, 2,000 damage. Jeez. And an intelligence drink. I'll take the ruby heart. And of course, as I always, take the opportunity right away, make him a little bit stronger. Boop. And then we don't need to use any field drinks because we are good to go. Let's go. Uh, Taking a look at the treasures, I think we're missing three. Yeah. We're missing three here and then three in the Spectrum world, so we're, we should be fine. Oh. Keep your eyes up and you don't want to miss anything. It's hard to believe that we'll be at the top of this place soon. Still, Nadir said that there was something I must come to understand before I can leave this place. Well, whatever it is, I know we can take it on together. Well, a team needs more work, after all. What's up, Matthias? Yo, buddy, what's happening? What's the matter? Oh, no. I feel like Matthias knows what's coming. Oh, no, my boy. My boy. Uh, the tux juice? Yeah, we need some of those sometimes, you know. Oh, God. Oh, God. All right. All right. Who doesn't like a good old puzzle? Well, to be honest, labyrinths are not so hard. The only problem with labyrinths is that you have to go back and forth so often just to be able to find where is it that you need to go. That's the only thing that I don't really like. Like, I do not know if that path to the right is correct or if I'm going to have to go back just to go through that path. Oh, hello there. Boo. Ready. Ooh, we don't like those. We do not like those. Good damage. Beautiful damage. Okay, that's more than enough. And then say goodbye. Ooh, one more for a level up. That's gonna be great. Uh, let's see. Yeah, so see the connection? 
going down and oh my god that's the one that we need fuck hello there they're ghost oh this is this is kind of like cute they're like ghost bread son i mean i guess ghost spreads are like kind of cute I, i'm testing something out this is not too smart not enough okay that's fine i just hear me out i needed to test it out i needed to make sure that it was gonna work it didn't work that's fine i'll take the damage it's my risk get the healing okay that's a lot of damage that's fine i needed to see if i could kill them so that way in future turns i can heal instead of doing basic damage but that's not the case so that's fine level up our focus went up yep you guys know what that means that means that with the focus up we're gonna fuck them up Go through the top let's see what else we can see the enemies that's gonna be easy i hope we're fast enough to like kill them but who knows treasure note 28 hard as hard as it may be beating a greedy chest might yield a reward what feeding a greedy chest might yield a reward what the fuck how do you feed a greedy chest Anyways, at least we know the tip. So now we gotta find a greedy chest. So it's probably gonna be a chest that is gonna talk to us and it's gonna ask me for something. And it's gonna ask me if I can give them like a fuel potion or something like that. And since we don't have money and we are broke because we have spent everything, we're probably gonna be like, no! And he's gonna be like, okay, buddy. Then I don't give you shit. But if I fit it, then it's gonna be like, yay! Who knows? Oh, this is cool. Let's fuck him up. They actually look pretty sick. It's a combination between multiple enemies. Pretty nice. And look at that. 190. Just like I said. Boom. 1740 damage. That's so disgusting. Or maybe the chest wants a cookie. Who knows? Having fun the chest. Okay. Two chests left and right. That's a greedy chest. Are you the greedy chest? Hey, buddy. Hey, Pat. I'm not giving any treasure. You'd better turn around and get lost if you know what's good for you. Ah, you got me on an empty stomach too. The nerve of some people. But yeah. Oh, what do you got in there? Gimme, gimme, gimme. Chum, 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 yum, 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 yum. Ah, that's some good grub right there. Still not giving you anything, sucker? Mother. Hey, pal, I'm still not giving you any treasure, so... You're such a pest. Still so hungry. Yep. Oh, what do you got? Um, yum, 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 yum. Ah, yes. Still not giving you anything. Oh my god, let's do it again. My treasure is too important to give to some pinkish purple longhead. But since you are here, yes. Oh yeah. Ah, delicious. Mmm. You ain't half bad, pal. Oh, it's you again. Did you bring the goods? Yep, here you go. Oh, what do you got in here? Delicious. Delicious. I knew I could call it you for the good stuff. And one more. Well, if it isn't my good friend. Come on, I'm starving here. Yep. Oh god, yes, that's even better than before. I don't think I could eat any other bite, I'm so full. You really pulled through for me, mysterious stranger. I do not think my treasure can fit inside here anymore, so here you go. There you go, regal chest. Hello, my best friend. Oh, I'm so full. Jesus, that was really expensive. I mean, I don't know if, if um, we're actually going to be able to... How do you call that? I have no idea if we're actually gonna be able to buy new armor and things like that once we're done because we spent so much money right here. Two more chests, by the way. We just wait. Oh, god damn it. The Crescent Moon Tower. A place where lost souls spend eternity with their wishes unfulfilled. A place between the previous world and the next. A place that shapes itself to the legacies that its inhabitants found in life before they were forgotten in death. And yet, you have helped them out find peace. Well, how could that be? I do not know. I've just been granting their wishes however I can. As long as I can help them find peace, that's all that matters, yes? It doesn't matter how I try. But how can you exist here? For you see, only the dead might inhabit the crescent moon. <laughs> Fucking called it, no hold on. So, what if they're dead? 
I'm still helping them. Yes. There is something here that you might wish to see. His name. Yeah. What is this? Each one of these graves tells the story of a life that ended. And this one tells yours. This is your final resting place. There is only one reason why you can exist here. You, you cannot mean... It's not possible! Your life came to an end. You are here in the crescent moon tower as a spirit between worlds, just like us. When you first arrived here, you did not survive the fall. It was at that moment that your story as a living being ceased. Do you think you can help him? My magic will not bring him back, but he can still exist here with us in the tower. I am glad. I'm so happy to see him again after so long. I think he could be the one to help us all. And maybe he can finally find peace. So, I really am dead. Then, what is even the point of everything I've been doing? Now that you know the truth, it is solely up to you to decide what to do next. There is still more to see. Whether or not you decide to learn of these things is your decision and yours alone. If you want to reach the top of this hour, I suggest you make the right choice. My own death. Huh. <sighs> but I mean, kinda, kinda saw that coming, right? It was like, yeah, oh, two more treasures and Jesus Christ, why are we missing 12,000 points? What the freak are we gonna give 12,000? So why are you missing two treasures? No, those points always worry me. Can I speak with it? No. I think that's what Matthias was sad. There's so much I wanted to do with my life. I wasn't even that old. Why me? It's not fair. Meow. I know you're itching to keep going, but what's the point to that now? I am just as dead as everyone else. How can I even go home now? Home is with Matthias, boy! Well, if you're so sure, then we'll just press on, I guess. Not that it makes a difference anymore. Sure. Keep your eyes open, there's nothing here. And here we go, baby! Oh god, no! My boy Matthias is gonna have to work hard for this one. Let's go, Matthias. First jump. Oh, 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 come on! Yo, that's... Come on! That was like the perfect... Oh, whoa, whoa! Oh! Listen, the, the, the mission right now is move without stopping. Move without stopping. Whoa, ho, ho, look at those moves, baby. Ho, 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 ho. Wait, 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 wait. wait. Do I want to go down? Or straight? Shit. 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 Fuck. No, it was just a field potion. God dang it. Wait. No. Oh, I got the moves. Oh, yeah. Look at this. Just give me all that money. And I saw this guy. Oh, baby. Press the button. It. Wait, but I saw somebody else in here. Oh, it's just going back. Whatever. I got it. You guys can eat poop. Press everything and you wanna fight me? That come on. <laughs> Listen, I'm I'm kinda sad. So when you're sad, the only way to like make things better is to like not be sad. And to not be sad, I need to kick some ass. And now I do wish I do wanna like level up twice. Because I think if I level up twice, my Meter will go to like 200 And 200% 200 sounds sick Just imagine that 200% attack And yo Not missing on this baby Uh first Oh god He got me Oh no those attack first Poison damage okay. Uh Let's finish it Nope That's beautiful Now to be fair To be fair even though the story is predictable On some aspects kind of cool that he actually was able to like it's like oh this is the afterlife and in spite of everything you are still able to like find your sister i think that's super awesome matching pictures will give a big smile 
Okay. And then this whole treasure section is more like you know that the, that the the quest is coming, so the moment that we go to the other side, we'll probably do the quest, and that's it. So it's like at this point, the game is like being pretty simple at the way that they do things because they're just building in for like a big moment. And I, I mean, of course, I'm guessing a lot of people will get shocked about the fact that we're pretty much dead dero. And I guess it was to be expected, honestly. But at the same time, let's be honest, a lot of us were hoping that he wasn't actually gone gone so and that our boy Sosma was actually gonna be able to like finally have his first adventure. In spite of that, find his sister and do everything. That would have been so awesome, but instead he found her in death. Is something the matter? You do not seem like yourself. Well, if my service can be of assistance then, what can I get you today? Listen, the only things that I want are like armor and things like that, so we don't care. You seem so glum. I do not know what I can do to help, but you can count on me like you have always done. Come on, trust me. Thank you. Let's go. Oi, uh, what is this? Excuse you. Okay, which way am I supposed to go? It seems like that's a correct one, so let's go up. Okay, we got it. I'll take the very elixir. Get it. Ooh! You guys saw that. I almost scratched that thing right, right in the ball hole. Oh, boy. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Bye. Uh, seems like this is the correct path, so let's go down. Uh, what are we getting here? Oh, it's... Wait. They we're talking about a big smile. And hello there. Matching pictures will bring a big smile. Gotcha. Okay, that's beautiful. I think this is one. That means that this is one, two. Beautiful. Then one, two, three over here. And then you take three at the bottom. So one, two, three. Beautiful. One, two, three. Beautiful. This is it. Yeah. Oh, look at that. And then not only that, but also a battle just Let's go. <laughs> really? What I figured by now that you guys are gonna bring the big boys against me. You guys know that the, the, the little boys, I mean, you can attack first throw and everything that you want, but the fact is that if you do not do enough damage, you're pretty much gone. At least in my book, you are dead. Level up. Not yet. One more. Thank you. That's a lot. Give me that. And we get a great coat. One more level. That's how we need. I'm sorry, one more treasure. That's how we need. So, bam, baby. Whoa, wait. Holy shit. Holy shit. Holy bullies. Come on. Let's go. Okay, we got it. Beautiful. Okay. Got the second one. Oh, you're not getting me like that. Not like this. Beautiful. And we got it. That's it. Let's go. Next section. Oh, wait. Why so many... Why so many coffins? So, you will continue onward still. I must say that you're quite determined. He's smiling. I'm not sure where I'm going or why. If I'm dead, then does it really matter what I do now? And yet, I've been helping the other dead spirits here move on into the afterlife. But what about you, Sosma? You must wonder why it has been placed on you to carry out such a task. Of course I do. Have you all cursed me to wander this tower forever to help the dead first rest, find rest? That's not the life I wanted. I wanted to carry you on the legacy of my sister. I wanted to finally be a great astral hunter. So, why does this have follow me and only me? Because Sosma. A part of you still rests within this tower, what? A part of you that can bring you back to the world of the living, what? There exists such a thing? Further ahead you will find the answer to all of this and more. Perhaps continue onward for just a little bit longer. The final answers you are looking for will become clear soon. A way home 
is within sight. But why? How? A way home. I think I think the game is gonna make me make a choice whether or not I wanna go home. Oh boy. Wait, multi end the game? But by the way, in case you guys are wondering whether or not I'm enjoying this game, I've been playing it for 12 hours already, so <laughs> pretty good game. Really good game. Okay, give me out of this. Thank you. Give me the coins. And just as always, let's make that check. We have 15,000, so we're getting closer. Perfect. Like that bunch that had like 5,000 or something in like diamonds. That was fantastic. We attack first. Yep. Goodbye. You guys know the strategy. Like at this point, does it even surprise anybody that I'm going to clap them cheeks? But you guys do have some awarding to receive for being the reason for my level up, I think. Oh, yeah. Delicious. Look at that. Speed 64. Oh, baby. Super fast. So which way do I want to go? Let's go down first. Yep. Give me all of this. There is some red balloons sitting here and there, so I wonder what are those for. Just out of curiosity. Oh, hello there. Well, you did have the opportunity to hit me, but I guess you didn't want to show up. Okay, let's fight. Oh, ready? Set? It would have been you. Would you imagine like this ghost? Like they share a uh, explosive and they were like ready, and the other one is set, and then. If you don't kill them in this turn, they will just both blow up at the same time and make your life miserable. Oh, that would have been awesome. Yeah, 3,000, you would need like around 5 fights. No, 7 fights to be able to level up. And here it is. Treasure note number 30. A true Astra Hunter would be well rewarded. A true Astra Hunter would be well rewarded. Hold on there, Buko. Only a tried and true treasure hunter is worthy of this. Time to check your rank. Let's see. Well, now you've made it to rank S. You've been diligent in collecting treasure, and I'd say you deserve a prize. Beautiful. All yours, Buko. Look at this. Oh, baby. Oh, yeah. Oh, ho, ho. Look at that. Mmm. So good. Check the treasures. Hunter rank. Everything completed, that's just perfect, and this is gonna be please be a and a speed potion. A wayfarer's ring, okay, that's better. And the moon figure, of course. And that final ring, which of course is gonna go to my boy, is attack, defense, intelligence, yeah, everything by four, yeah, too good. Especially the speed by four, that's just too good. You cannot say no to that, that's just insane. We are maxed out in everything that we needed, we are perfect. So to get this, you need everything. Glad you could make it here. I mean, I wouldn't be doing very well without you around financially anyways. Uh, what can I get you today? Do you sell... <sighs> Stupid muffin box. This is useless. I wanted something better, but that's fine. Oh, wait. I have an idea. Something that I want to do is buy four of this, four of this, four of this. And uh, yeah, four of this. Uh, this made me go broke, but I think we're fine. And safe. You're here. Oh, I was worried sick that you wouldn't make it in here. And I know just the thing you need. Ah, oh, thank you. We got almost everything. Let's go. Sosma, unlike the other spirits of this tower, an important piece of you has been left virtually intact. Your soul. My soul. Matthias. Your soul still exists in this place. And it was because of its presence that this one was able to awaken to come to your aid. Your friend will be the key to reclaiming your soul. And with it, your path back to the world of the living will open when you reach the top. After all, they have kept your soul protected through your journey. You have done well to find the first five pieces. Before you lie the sixth and final piece of your soul. With this, it will become whole again. Oh! With your soul completed, you can return to the world of the living. This is what we ask of you. Return to the surface world and carry on the legacy of everyone you've befriended in this tower. I... I guess it's your turn to shine, huh? Let's go, Matthias! I'm still waiting for Matthias to grow arms and legs and be like, Daddy, it's me, but it's not gonna happen. Oh, 
The sixth piece of my soul. It feels warm. Yeah. Meow. I wasn't expecting this. Even if it makes me a hundred years, I hope I can become an Astra Hunter worthy of your legacy. I just hope you won't be disappointed in me. The Neb. The Neb kinda sucks, don't you think? <laughs> we cannot let everyone down. Let's get home. Oh! I feel like we can fart now! New power. Memories light. And with that, your soul is complete. However, in the state it is, you cannot reclaim it. You would need the bed's help. And so I ask you. Boss level, I'm gonna guess 24. To prove that you are capable of this. 25, wow. It's a little bit stronger. The nep is counting on us. Yep. Whatever happens, we'll do this together. The power of friendship and love! Yay! <laughs> Let's go, baby. When I was alive, I studied arcane magics and spells that would bring about new life for those who deserved a second chance. As I discovered, these magics have only been opened to me through my own death. But if I can help even just one person live, live on to carry on the legacy of others, then all of my research will have not been for naught. Sosma, you will go home, do you not? Of course I do! I have so many things in life that I wish to experience. I cannot just stay dead here. I have a life to go back to. Then show me that you are capable of living on. Da -dun 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 -dun. Not there. Shifter of fate. Let's go! Oh, whoa, 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 what's happening right now? Okay, okay, let's start, let's start sick, okay? Power focus. And a couple of fire sunders right here. Yep, that's one. Two. We know that they're gonna survive, but that's fine. Anyways, run around. Boom, baby. Oh, okay, I need to, I need to strategize this a little bit better, okay? I I'm gonna have to use seal. No, seal is a bad idea right now. Start with this. That's nice. Now we can use seal. That's good. And now we can go back to this thing. That's one. Two. Three. Um, what does this do? Massive magic damage to all enemies. Oh, that sounds cool. Ah, uh, team tackle. Go for it, baby. 900 damage, but everything else goes down. Beautiful. Oh, and they're... Wait, wh why are they losing so much health? That's insane. Anyways, we can go for this. They're all gonna go down. You guys know the deal. And right now, I'm not gonna do anything. Because I want my next run to be the big hit. That's disgusting. That's disgusting. But hey, this is fine. This is fine. This is fine. No, no, no. I'm gonna take my chances because I think I can survive. I think I can kill them all. Okay, that's three. Wait, can I do something else? Yeah, I can do a meteor strike. Wait, I think I messed up. No, I didn't. Oh, yeah, I think I fucked up. Shit. Oh, that's bad. Okay, I don't have a choice. Finish them off. Uh, do I have a choice? Not really. I don't have power. Uh, 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 run around. Oh, shit, they're all alive. I spent my life trying to defy the fate that befalls of all. I thought I could be the one to solve the greatest mysteries since life inception. I only ever wanted to give people a chance to see what life has to offer for longer than this world will have us. I'm so dead. Yes. Oh god, that was disgusting if I gotta be honest. I wasn't expecting that. But I'm kinda happy that the game does that. Like instead of like super punishing you. The game kinda like allows you to uh, restart and that's gonna be great. Seal now. Yeah, I gotta play smart there. I did something super dumb. 
Uh, that was a lot of damage, but I'm fine. I'll take my chances right there. Should have used a healing power, but that's fine. 76, 114%. 150%. Beautiful. And now let's throw memory slide. Let's see what happens. Oh, that's 2,000 damage. That's Oh, come on, Matthias. The healing, bro. The healing. Flash cure. That's great. And a couple of slashes should do the trick. Let's focus on one of them. Let's go. Next run, they both go down. Nice healing, Matthias, my boy. What the fuck with that damage? Excuse you? Okay, I'm taking down your friend right now. What the? Excuse me? Okay. I gotta be smart right now. I think I can... Okay, let's start with a... Jesus Christ, what's going on with this battle? Okay, now I want another item. Can I do a massive healing? Yes. Moon candy. Okay, we have a couple of turns. So right now what's going to happen is that we're going to use... Uh, Comet Storm? Uh, not really. Grand Gamble? That could be good. Now I'm going to use Team Tackle right here. That's a lot. And then we're going to be using that thing that we saw, the Moon Candy. Let's go. And now we're capped out so we can start using Disgusting Attacks. That's going to be really nasty what he's about to do. So the only way that I can see this working is Steel Fortress. Yes. Perfect. And then let's start do, doing some Fire Sunders in here. One. Second one. That's perfect. Can I do three of these? Yes, I can, I think. Perfect. Yeah, we, we do know that. Yeah, you will not solve anything. You cannot give people what they want. They just get what they need. You weak ass. Wait. He killed me so I don't have seal anymore. Frick. That's fine. Oh, what is seal? What is seal? What is seal? Here. I gotta say, this is a disgusting fight. Like, this battle, not easy at all. With what little time we are given, we can never truly see everything that the world has to offer. I wanted people to see more of it. And more importantly, to remember each other as if we had never passed. Many of us are eventually forgotten. But what impact did they have in shaping the future? Uh, I don't know, buddy, but... Just eat some shit. Ah, uh, Now, we only get one healing. So everything that we do right now has to be super carefully calculated. So Bastion... Let's start hitting this guy. One. Second. Beautiful. And with that, just a meteor strike should do the trick. Chain break, that's not good, but... A chain link. Wait, don't we have a better one? Uh, not really. So I'll just use chain link. That's perfect. We remove the chain break, and then we can start with another fight under. One hit. Second one and the next color portal ones is gonna do so much damage to you. What is it? What is your impact on the world, Sosma? What will you do to shape the future for others? Will you continue to accomplish nothing and fade into obscurity? Or will you change the world in a way that can be felt? I you do not know anything. You know nothing about me! Okay, he's gonna hit me, but next bat next turn he he loses. Yeah, we already understand how this battle works, so we... This this battle is won. Meteor Strike. And then, can we do more Meteor Strikes? We can. Beautiful. A Firepower, goodbye. Beautiful battle. That was hard. And a Miracle Drink, that probably gives me plus one of everything. I expected no less from someone with your determination. Great job. By overcoming the power, now we are more closer than ever. Now my ABP is increased by 2. And we have the ability Barrage.
I see that you are almost ready to return to the surface world, but you must ask yourself, why is it that you defy the fate that befell everyone else here? I'm not sure really. I've granted everyone's wishes and brought peace to so many souls. I just... Perhaps you were chosen for a special purpose. After all, everyone here has a wish that needs granting. Mine was already granted long before I met you. I wish to see that you had the resolve to live on and you performed well and you performed well through your adventure. To put it simple, I wished to finally grant someone a second chance. And with that, there is only one wish left to grant. The net. I believe my role in your adventure is fulfilled. Bye, bitch. See you on the other side. I know you'll be the one, Sosma. Don't keep your sister waiting. Hi. So it's finally time. Nadir, a man who understood the thrones of death and the fate of others. In life, he knew full well that people have spent millennia searching for a way to elude the embrace of death. And yet, he never stopped looking for a way. It was only after his own death that he could perform such a feat. To bring you back from the brig is not an easy task. And now you are here, nearly whole again. Deneb, whatever you wish is, I am ready to grant it. I just want to help you, just like how I have helped everyone else in this tower. And I cannot do that unless you tell me. I help you find the peace that you deserve, whether I am alive or dead. So please. I will not make you wait any longer. You have helped everyone else in this tower and I must thank you for the, from the bottom of my heart. I shall tell you my wish soon, but first, you must finish up anything else here in this tower that you want to do. I shall return you to Bedwick's so that you might tie up any loose ends. Please meet me back here whenever you're ready. The top of the Crescent Moon Tower is just ahead. We face so many challenges, I have seen so many great things here. Let's finish this up. We need to do. Let's finish up what we need to do and help the Neb. It's now or never. New tier expanding boy, Sharon. A new equipment is available. And that, you guys know it. This is where we finally wrap things up for the day. Next episode, we'll go to the shop. We'll get some things going. We'll explore our new adventure rank, which I believe has not improved. So probably we have to complete absolutely everything before the adventure rank goes higher. And then probably a final battle against the Nep. Who knows? But anyways, I hope that you guys enjoyed it. Thanks a lot for watching as always. And I'll see y'all in the next one.